Mercenary Field in Chirac, Illinois is the setting for today's MFL action. The historic site is where aliens first made contact with Earth, landing their spaceships inside the stadium and demanding a lifetime supply of Italian beef sandwiches. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The San Francisco 49ers take on the Midway Mutants. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs! Mutants I'd like to fuck! He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you half-wit. Oh! I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime mutant lingerie girls team! On a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all? Ho ho! Va 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 boom! And it's first and ten. I not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. Hot one, hot two. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third down and five. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he's got a chance for a good return here. He Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant beat. All I need is 77 to bite it. Father of blown up mutants right in his face. Mm, actually, my pin of proven. That guy was ugly. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Wrestling? <laughs> Second down and nine. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. You know, a lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the ground crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. First and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. The quarterback has had enough. I just may be in commentary, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right. You should. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. 
Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Much like our wedding night, there was a big explosion, but then everyone left disappointed. Everyone? You had more than two people in the room? Yeah, the guy filming in the clown. And the defense goes for the jugular and rushes to kill the... And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway, exit five. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Well, sure, now he catches it. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. Boom! Second down and five. Interception like Bricks' bowels. He is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that Guy Bricks. You're an idiot. Touchdown! Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They just be... The kick is good! <laughs> As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. nets them seven yards. Ah, oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of them again? You stick it in a plastic bag, say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire. And, and the quarterback throws another pick. He should have been... One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog turns on my front porch every day. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. Then he won't be able to read the message. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should... The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's hit the third. Here comes the defense. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. And that'll be a first down. You know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf, huh? First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And this guy has quite the female following. Listen to them. Yeah, they all want to jump his bones. I wish the middle linebacker would have jumped his bones. I just lost a saw buck on that play. The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. You need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. At the end of the first quarter, this one looks like a rout. Someone give me a beer. crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And he's off to the races. Second down and seven. The defensive players go berserk. The ball just sliced through the defense like... And he held on to that one for a first down. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. First and ten. Oh, nice hit. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And like a monkey trying to fuck him into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. And here 
comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My turn on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't Logan. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And they call it. Oh, and he took a leap and had the ball knocked out. Fumble. He's got a case of fumbleitis. First and ten. Second down and a lot. was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck raccoon ravy blood is my thought always a player's favorite over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. Second down and 10. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Third down and eight. Hot, hot one. It's about a oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. A misfired punt will give the opposing... And he snags the punt. Hey, Bricks, you were hit more than a few times like that in your career. 140 times to be exact, and one game to be more exact. During one play to be more and more exact. It wasn't even a game, actually. Coach just laid into me on the sidelines. And that'll be second down and four. He 
might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. I'm adding anything really tastes good. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. The offense lost another running back and only drew a main on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Quarterback drills one in for the first down. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. You gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore win. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Two minutes left in the half. coaching move at this point of the game. I'm a listen to this blasphemy! I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust! In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he could Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome! I hope they had raincoats in the front row, because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. And he punched him like Bricks' bowels. He is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Grim. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. was an all-pro NFL hit. The QB saved some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. Second down and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. He did it! He scores! And with that amazing run, he bursts through the end zone for six. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good.
They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. This guy's a brick shithouse. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still... The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the fuel looks expensive, that is. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first timeout. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused! If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. Well, the game is this close as the score indicates. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Oh, and they just deflated the quarterback's balls right there. Second down and more than the QB would like. Third down and forever. Hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And it's first and ten. free and has open field in front of him. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Passing game, picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. Second and three. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! Third down in the offense. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the kill. If he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, kiss -ka say what the fuck the fuck the fuck The offense has only one 
quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Ah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. Third down and six. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math after that hit what's math exactly and it's first and ten at this rate the QB is gonna have more interceptions than completions Ooh, that hits gonna shave a few days off his life First and ten. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. And that's why he's a defense schmuck. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in. Man, oh man, they lined up and f just and they get stumped cold. Hey, Grim, remember what I said when Bricks wanted to bring in a fish buffet in our tiny air seal broadcast booth? I believe that was. Who could have thought that was a good idea? Yeah, just check it. I'm thinking that again. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed... Oh, come on. That was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. First and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. And he picks up the loose ball and rumbles into the end zone for the score. Nice going. The kicker died on that play. That's terrible. Now what do they do? Well, another player will assume the kicking 
roll for the remainder of the game. And Coach is praying he won't need a long field goal to win this one. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Defense has the receivers covered well. That's a three-yard gain on that pass. Second down and seven. Ah, another interception. Jeez, you give it. Oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. And it's first and ten. Not one. to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can see that, man. Turn your back and do it. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ten. Defense gets another. Man, what a hit. That guy is not getting up. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. Freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. And the other said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. <laughs> the Midway Mutants destroyed the opposition today. There is no one left to play, so they win by forfeit. There is not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Uh, how about it? How about if you I... shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Grim Blitrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's 
game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.